Good morning, guys. Happy Wednesday. I am dead tired. Um, I got a hat on so you can't see the hair, what's going on up here. I just woke up, so you guys don't want to see that. Um, nothing really fun playing today. I got to ship a couple things out. Um, I got work in a few hours, so I wish I could show you guys. Like, it's just so much fun. Show you all the dogs and how awesome they are. But, I can't. But I would love to. Just know that. Um, so yeah. We'll see what I can do today. Um, <clears throat> yes, I do wear glasses. I wear contacts. That's what you'll usually see me in. The only time I'll be wearing glasses is when I wake up. And guess what? I just woke up. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna go, I gotta pack a couple things for shipping, so I'm gonna put you on the good old GoPro on a time lapse probably. Um, so yeah, enjoy. <laughs> you guys would want to say good morning to the doggies um you could probably guess where fred is where he's not supposed to be and stanley is in the right spot but they just he just doesn't learn like if anyone can train him hit me up train him please oh my gosh what are you eating dude he is eating like one of those micro fiber cloths. Uh, which he shouldn't have. And he shouldn't be on the couch. But you know, he doesn't care. Look where the good dog is. Stan, you're the good dog. Can't forget the cat. And now watch Fred attack him. Fred, what do you have? When he gets something he's not allowed to have, just runs in circles all day. Let's try to find him. Hey, what do you got? Fred, come here. Come here. Come here. Give me the sock. You see what I'm dealing with? It's it's ridiculous. For those of you that are huge Harry Potter fans like me, um, this is a great um, series. It's called The Magicians. It's on Netflix if you want to watch it. Um, but yeah, the books are amazing. They're great books. I also have this sweet Harry Potter collectible Quidditch set. Let's see if I can open it. Alright, inside of it is the quaffle, two bludgers, and then of course the golden snitch that you can't get out. Of course, because why could you? This, this thing actually weighs like a good three pounds. But yeah. Like I said yesterday, if you love sports, then you definitely need to hop on DraftKings or FanDuel. Great chance to win money. I mean, there's a chance to lose money. There's a chance to lose money in anything you gamble. But, bunch of fun. And it's just a different way of watching sports. I always tell you the breakfast of champions. This is the lunch of champions. Dead honest. Alright, so you start with salami on a hamburger bun 
best, way better than white bread. Go to some spicy nacho Doritos. Go to some peanuts, fruit snacks, and you guys can already guess what I drank. Capri Sun. But yeah, best lunch you'll ever have fills you up. Mmm, good stuff. Okay, so you guys remember yesterday when I said it's been 60 degrees and rainy like all winter. It's 20 today and we're getting snow tonight. I jinxed the crap out of us. So now, gotta rock a big old UC jacket to try to stay warm. Alright guys, I'm at work. I will see you guys in eight hours. Take it easy. So I just got home from work. Another day with working with dogs. Can't beat it. Gonna chillax, watch some UC, eat some dinner. Show you guys what I'm chowing down on tonight for dinner. Big potato, hamburger with ketchup. That's how you do it. My dinner was amazing. Um, baked potato and hamburger. That's top notch for me. That's all I need in life. Make me a baked potato every night. Whew. Good stuff. You guys remember when it was 60 degrees yesterday? Gosh, I jinxed us so bad. <laughs> 62 to 20 in snow. Awesome. Alright, I'm watching UC right now. They're playing UCF, which is University of Central Florida. They have a guy that is seven foot six on their team. It is ridiculous. His name is Taco Fall. He's got an awesome name too. You guys see him in the middle right there, number 24 in black. He is huge. That guy in white right there is like six eight. He's almost a foot taller than him. Look at him come up here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that is so unfair. Another win. Keep it rolling, guys. Sorry I'm not doing anything fun tonight, guys. It's nothing really to do. Um, on a Wednesday night when you get off work at 9. Besides, watch TV. So, if you need a good TV show and you have cable, watch Hunted. Um, I think it's on CBS. Um, but like, 10 groups of two. Um, try to escape from some cops. They're not fugis fugitives or anything, but um, they're acting like it. And if they get uh, away with it, like without getting captured for 30 days, they get some money. I don't know the prize. Um, didn't really pay attention to that. I like the concept of the show, so I probably didn't explain that good at all. So I'm going to let the TV show explain it. I'll just show a clip from the beginning and they tell you about it. Everything we do in our daily lives leaves a digital trail. For law enforcement, these everyday routines can help them stay one step ahead of the criminals. Now, 18 ordinary U.S. citizens are going on the run as fugitives. They got it. Don't move. I get to find out if I've got what it takes to escape the best hunters in the world. We're all around you. You might as well just pull over. And if they can evade capture for 28 days, oh my God. they will win $250,000. Hunting them down are 32 of the top investigators in the world. It works. New password. We can now log in. I want these folks caught. Move in. Stop! The time on the run is over. 28 days. 18 fugitives. If you had to disappear, could you? So yeah, I think it's a super good idea um, for a TV show. If you guys want to check it out, CBS Wednesday nights. It's definitely worth a watch. Alright guys, that's going to do it for me today. I will be back tomorrow. Sorry there wasn't really anything fun today besides me packing some stuff for shipping, which I know isn't the funnest thing in the world. But trust me, good stuff's coming. But other than that, you guys have an awesome rest of your night. I'll see you back here tomorrow. Take it easy now.